small town And live in a small town Probably die in a small town Oh, a small community No matter how often John Cougar Mellencamp, this small town guy, takes to the road to take his music to the people, he always takes that road back home again. This may seem like an unlikely place for a recording studio outside of Bloomington, Indiana, in the cold Midwest. But it is here that Mellencamp records his own particular brand of hot rock and roll from the heartland. I've learned that I can't create anything, uh, except from here. You know, you got to have perspective from where you see the world. And see, look at that. Look at those horses walking out there. Isn't that great? I just kind of am a reporter, you know. I just kind of reported from a, out here in the middle of nowhere. Here's the, here's the human condition of people my age. The fans who come to see Mellencamp are paying to see a rock star, not a reporter. But Mellencamp does come to report. On his new hit, Paper and Fire, he reports on a young man's foolish vanity. And on Cherry Bomb, he sings with nostalgia about younger days. If Mellencamp's perspective seems more mature today than that of the younger, rebellious John Cougar of old, it may be because of the way he now views his role as a father. John's daughters and their friends play backstage at his concerts. His two-year-old Justice is a real Mellencamp music fan. It's like falling in love, you know, that was great about falling in love initially, is that you forget about yourself and you always want to do for the other person, you see. Uh, kids are like that, you know, you, you want to do for them all the time. And uh, you quit thinking about yourself so much. And to me, I mean, that's what I have learned recently from having kids is that you need to be that way with uh, the world. Forget about yourself you know, and start thinking about other people. On tour with John Cougar Mellencamp on Nina Blackwood Entertainment Tonight.